If you're a fan of the smash hit show Downton Abbey, maybe you're developing a craving for the aristocratic lifestyle, but maybe, maybe your blood isn't blue, or maybe it's just <laughs> too rich for your blood. Well, this is style expert Mar Jennings. You're back with us today. Thanks yes. for coming in to give us a little taste of the Downton Abbey distinction at proletariat prices. <laughs> Absolutely. Can we say that? Yes. All right. So th anyway, so you have a little bit of interaction. I here do. I do. And you know, I think it's important to realize that we're getting very inspired by it, both in how we're dressing as well as our lifestyle in our home and the things that we're doing in reference to entertaining. Mm -hmm. and I think Maggie Smith said it so beautifully, and she said, "Nothing wreaks success better than excess," and you don't. Don't have to spend a lot of money though to achieve that same look. And uh, I had a lot of help from the friends at uh, Home Goods, but we have a little exam for you. Okay. We're going to pick right in front here. There are three different plates. I want you to three pick plates. the one that is the most expensive plate. I'm going to, just for the heck of it, because it's the, sort of the most understated, I'm just going to guess this one here. You are correct. It's um, the most expensive. That is the most expensive, but it's funny that you went the complete opposite yeah. because that's the most simplest plate. It is, yeah. And these ones are really much more opulent, I think. Very opulent. And right now, people are getting married, and they're not even registering for China anymore. But China is such a very important part of the overall experience when you're dining. Yes. So I say you can pick up some really wonderful deals, and whether it be a charger or or even a dessert plate, and just really step up the experience when it comes to dining at home. Okay, now, copper pots. Well, copper pots, very expensive, and it's often that you see in Downton Abbey, you know, the lifestyle of the upstairs and downstairs. So I want you to pick a copper pot that is $150. I'm going to guess the big one. The big one? Yeah. All right. Well, let me just tell you that all of them yeah. equal $150. You're kidding. All of them. So what a great collection. For less than $150, you can have the same look. And what's wonderful about copper pots is that if you are a person that loves to cook, yep. you're going to notice the difference because it conducts heat very differently. I was going to say, it's not only beautiful, but it has some really nice properties, too. Absolutely. Okay, so now next? we have this tablescape here. And what I want you to do is I want you to look at everything on the table. And I want you, Jeff, to select two items that really are over $50. So you're going to look at combined or, or individually. Or Visually. Okay, so oh, we have boy. some glasses here that look a lot like Waterford. Okay. I love all the great detail. This one's a set of six. This is four, yeah. four. Then we have this silver tray because, of course, every time um, a footman or a butler would serve someone, they have to serve it on a tray. Okay. So we have a silver tray. We have a candy dish, very popular. Uh, we have some candlesticks right here, crystal candlesticks, a very decorative box, and we have the cherry glass. This is a set of six. So. Find two items that are over fifty dollars. You know, Bob Barker. It's different for him. He retired because he'd, he'd have a, he'd have to worry about you. Um, I'm gonna guess the, the silver the sil tray. Silver tray. Okay, let's uh, take a look. Forty nine ninety nine. So it's, you're wrong. Okay. Go uh, ahead. I'm gonna One more choice. The candlesticks. Candlesticks. Let's turn that around. That's actually four ninety nine. Okay, really? each. All right. So let me just tell you, everything here yeah. is under fifty dollars. You're, you're see, every that, item here. That's not is fair. Under fifty dollars. I tricked you're, you. You don't play fair, and as a, as a penalty, I'm taking all the candy. There you go. <laughs> so listen, here's a perfect example how if you put all these things together, you get that really wonderful look in your home yeah. for a lot less. And it's about really training the eye on what you love and how you can incorporate those elements in your home. And it's not not about spending a lot of money. It's about really training your eye to find quality things. And there's so many off-price stores to do that with. But the idea is that once you discover those resources, you'll never turn back. Now, a really inexpensive way to enjoy Downton Abbey is just to step up your manners, and of course, and have civil conversation. Think extended, right? And let's have some tea. But mm. I think uh, this is a good way to help you remind you of yeah. all those great things. There's a reason people call you a style expert, <laughs> Mar Jennings, and I'm always reminded of it every time you're here. Thank you so much for My coming. My pleasure. Did, this is you really did well. Fun. Well, I did okay, but uh, you know, not bad for an amateur. And not bad at all. And certainly a, a wor you know a working stiff. Now, when but, you come uh, to my house, you'll see all these things at work. Life on Mars. <laughs> That's right. Thanks very much. And